All right, over the last few years, I've been asked a lot of questions. The one question that comes up all the time is this one. Why Disney? Why go from being a young, independent, upstart entrepreneur with Club Penguin to joining one of the largest media companies in the world? And my answer has remained the same. We had a bigger vision, a bigger story to tell than what we could possibly do and accomplish on our own. What, I, what, what excites me is, is what we've talked about, this kind of, this um, connection point of what used to be very discreet experiences mm -hmm. for kids, whether it's watching a movie, playing with a toy, um, you know, interacting with a website or online. Mm -hmm. uh, all of these, this convergence that's happening makes for, um, it's a very kind of unstable place, but for, for a lot of companies, because they're like, well, should I be focusing on toys? Should I be focusing on right. games? Should I be looking at, you know, new technology? Should I... Going forward, I think we're just going to continue to see more and more of an evolution of of the of the user experience of the, uh, of any, the play patterns. Any thoughts about multi-touch? Uh, the iPad. I do have some thoughts about multi. Yeah. I know you finally got your iPad. You've been tracking on that one for what uh, two years now. Uh, yes, I have. I have. Since, yeah, I read little, your stuff. A little puddle of pixels waiting to be splashed. I know. In. It's it's gonna it's gonna be bigger than what people realize. I'll I, tell you that. I will, uh, go, I will go on record to say it is gonna be significantly bigger than what people realize. Right now. Mm -hmm. And I think the potential for it um, is huge. And not just I mean, the potential in this area is one thing, but the potential for storytelling in general, the potential for um, connectivity for learning for I mean that's one of the things we've talked about before and too uh, it's funny because I actually um, forwarded a link to CTR to um, the headmaster at our son's school because he was like I don't know about you know games and DS and da -da. I said well do you let your kids watch TV and he goes, oh yeah but only like an hour a day I said well I tend to try and navigate my kids towards games for whatever their screen time is you know you need to limit screen time but I would much rather have my son problem solving on a DS yeah. than just sitting passively in front of a in front of a screen. And so for for me, um, uh, again, I think this is something that when you have all of the world's information sitting in front of a screen and an experience that is instantly accessible. And you know, my daughter at two years old was navigating, showing off photos of herself to you know, aunts and uncles on the iPhone because it was just so intuitive. I yeah. think when that level of, of an intuitive interface connects with all of the world's information connected online. And what's it, what, so what's going to mean for cars and, and Club Penguin? Uh, we've got some thoughts. Club we've Penguin got some Touch. Plans. We've got some plans. We've got some things we're kicking around. I bet. Unfortunately, nothing, all right, so, so nothing what, I can talk to uh, the fine folks on the camera. About yeah, so yet. let's just say for the fine folks on the camera that... Um, it's, it appears, from all indications, that this reporter has discovered an intelligent life form <laughs> at, the, at the helm of a very powerful media empire. And that could make some interesting things. So with that, we'll turn our camera off, and then we Sounds can get good. to the real stuff. So. Sounds good. All right, thank you. <laughs>